Okay, so this short video comes from a comment that I received on Creality Print 6.0. Uh, basically, it reads in 6.0, when you add a negative cylinder to make a hole in a part, you do it, but it doesn't make a hole like in, in the part like 5.1. Is it something I'm not doing right? Well, I'm not sure what you're doing, but I'm going to demonstrate real quick how to do that. Now, first off, Reality has updated 6.0 already. Um, the short lived 6.0.0.1074, which was the initial release, has been replaced. So you want to make sure you have 6.0.0.1078. Okay, so let's move on to creating a hole. I have a base right here. I'm just going to throw a hole in it. This, this is the part that's been sliced. Let's go back to prepare. I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to add a negative part and I'm going to hit cylinder. And you could do this with any shape. This message is telling you that you are working in the per object mode, not the global mode, which means I'm working on only the cylinder right, now, which is great. And we'll see it down here in the corner as transparent. So I'm going to go ahead and simply move that to where I want it to be. Slide that over and up. I'm going to change the scale in the Z direction real quick. I'm going to turn off my uniform scale and I'm going to change that 30 to 70. Well, I guess I'm not. Change it to 70. Okay, so we can see it's sticking up through the top. Now let's move it just a little bit more so we're not interfering with anything that any of the cuts that are already there. We'll move it right there and when I you can move it to where you want it to be um, so let's go ahead and we're going to slice the plate and see what we got and there's our hole right there and that's all there is to it I hope this helps you if you did hit that like button smash the bell and please if you haven't done it yet consider subscribing thanks